Do me a favor, guys. Pause. Go grab a Sleeman, a Coors Light, your favorite in the state spotlight. Do me a favor. This might be a little bit of talking in this video. This is Drew, and everyone knows my name, so write down below. No, you know, come on. Say my name. Say, come on. No, I can't hear you. Beer for breakfast, facts for snacks here. Anyways, I've never reviewed a blue. Oh, heartbreaking, eh? Well, not really, because how, like, I, I, how is this the most exported beer from Canada? A Labatt Blue, really? How is this 4.7 in the States? Which, pause there. I will do a review later on this year to see which one's better because I want to say the one in the States because this is shit. Okay? And now I lost track. Um, So, just figure this out. Help me out here. Why is it less percent and more up here? Yet, we made Labatt Blue. Us Canadians created Labatt and made it 5%. Why are you guys making it 4.7 down, down in the States? Also, when you get a Moosehead or a Canadian, it's not different alcohol. So why are they making it down there and up here? Let's get into this because I'm uh, a little fed up and uh, there's a reason why I have never done it. This is a big 740, um, which I got today and walked out and apparently I never paid for it. So it's a free beer. I like free beer. Do you like free beer? I definitely, when I look at the receipt, go, oh, thank God I never spent 350 on that or $4 on that big one. Anyways, I'm not a Labatt fan. Uh, well, I love Labatt. I'm not a Labatt blue fan. I did a review on the ice and the light. Lockhorn. It is. So you get that snap, crackle, pop, rice crispy in my new Ewish, uh, Ewish is that a word? Ewish, maybe, maybe, maybe in Africa it means like you cocksucker, Ewish. I don't know. I don't. I'm just saying. I, maybe Ewish is a word. I've got, that's just me. Okay. Um, big upside down snowfall. It's a, it's a macro. How is this the most exported beer from Canada to the world? If you're in China, you could get a Labatt Blue. But why do they make it different in the States? And like I said, you're going to see that review, the comparison, later on this year. It's, I can't wait because I'm hoping the 4.7 is way better. I got to get into this. Sorry for rambling on. Cheers, everyone. Too happy whenever June, whatever. Yeah. After hump day, whatever. Yeah. Mm. So it's bland. But they get... I, I, th I don't know what they do here. Like, And I love Canadian. I love Moosehead. What's going on here? And it, that's that's my whole thing is uh, it's planned. And that's why I want to do a comparison from the States. Maybe they have flavor. Maybe maybe they, they, they made a, a ingredients and did something to it because they realized us Canadians made a shitty beer. It's not very good. Uh, it, you know, this is, uh, you know, it, it, what, what's a shitty beer down in the States? Well, right now it's Bud Light. And Bud Light's way better than this. But people won't buy it because of the commercials. Because they fucked up. Advertisement. So let's go buy a shitty blue over a better Bud Light, right? right because of advertisement. So think about that. Yes, they screwed up. Go get yourself Bud Light, guys. This is ridiculous. You might hate me for that. I'm just saying. Um, I get it. And the boycott is doing good. $25 billion later. Jesus, I could buy Brantford with $25 billion. So why don't you just send that money to me? I'll buy Brantford. And I'll buy everyone a case of beer. How's that sound? This is this is a 6 out of 10. Uh, it's... I feel like it was better way back then, when it wasn't uh, when it wasn't like a, a, it's down to a cheap beer here. I'm rambling on. I told you, just it, pause again if you need our beer, and then come back, man. Because I'm right here all the time. This guy right here has like 1,800 videos, so you can watch me all the time. Topless, pool, bikini, speedo might come up. Never know. Six out of ten. Try something different, guys. Um, <coughs> Where's that? Oh. Oh. 
All right, have a good one. Be kind to your neighbors. Cheers.